Hey guys, another quick tutorial for you. Um, a lot of us shoot with uh, flashes and uh, I do most of the time and I usually try and get it right in one shot which leads to hotspots because you have to be very creative with where you put the flashes. As you can see in this frame, um, the corner is incredibly hot and I've got a very quick and easy way to uh, sort of mask that out. All we need to do, new layer, change that layer mode to multiply Grab your brush, and then uh, I've got mine set to about 30% opacity. Sample a color with Alt of roughly the middle of the ceiling, and just paint over the hotspot. Having uh, your layer blend mode set to multiply will allow the details to come through from the uh, the bit you're painting, the layer you're painting on, uh, or underneath, I should say. Um, and well you can change the actual color on top so as you can see here that's made it a lot more uh, natural looking and if I wanted to I could uh, paint over the whole ceiling and bring it back perfectly um, that's also the same for white ceiling so you can see here I've got a shot quite nice but the uh, the hotspot here is a is a little too hot for me um, basically you're gonna use the same mode new layer multiply and what I'm going to do, I'm just going to refine this selection a little bit here because um, it's a little tricky and I don't want to be painting over everything. just want to be painting over the ceiling. don't have to be super, super accurate. You can always use a layer mask later on and uh, paint in or paint out what you don't want. But for the purpose of this demonstration, I'll just show you here. Again, sample a color and paint over. Do, 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 do. Quite simple. Deselect. If I wanted a little bit darker in this corner, I could just sample a slightly darker area and do that. I've also got a hot spot up here. I can see a reflection on the range hood. I'll use a different method here. I'll just use a slight uh, gradient. This uh, curtain doesn't need to be in the reflection. I find that a little bit distracting. So the reflection of the light's quite nice. I'll try and keep that in. I'll just do a quick selection around the range hood glass. Like that. Select gradient with G. Select one color which I want in the corner. X to change my brushes. And the other side, I probably want the same as this. And all I'm going to do is drag over. Oops, wrong direction. Always do that. Uh, keep dragging over until I like it. Or do I want it the other way? It's the beauty with gradients. You can sort of pick and choose whichever which way you'd like. All right, that's probably most realistic. Somewhere around there. There we are. Okay. Once that's done, I can actually just use a mask and paint in the light that was there. Beautiful. So there we have it. The hotspots uh, sort of been that little issue's been solved, and the uh, reflection in the rain shot's been taken care of. So there you go. Nice quick one. Uh, getting rid of hotspots with using multiply. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll catch you in the next one.